Hi, this is Anna. Welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to share with you these four journals. Uh, these journals are made with um, these envelopes. This one is uh, off-white color, but I used four different colors. This one is blue. This one here is, that's this color. So I used different colors of these envelopes. And I was showing these envelopes in one of my Tuesday morning videos. These are French, made in France, and they have this lining inside, so they're kind of double. Great quality paper as well, textured. So I used these envelopes to make the covers for these journals, and then I used a piece of paper that went inside of it. So that was the cover. And one of these journals is was first so is a little bit different it's this one okay so then I made few changes so I'll start with this one so they basically are very similar almost the same they have um, lace on this side here let's just do one by one it's going to be easier this way so this one has this charm on a split ring right here and then the rest of the journals have the uh, binder ring so this is attached to the binder ring and you can open it easily versus this one you can remove it it's not as easy since i put it in there you can still remove it it's just not easy to take it um, to put it on and off and then they all come with this uh, bottle cap epoxy charm. So they tie with seam binding. And I included different seam binding, different color seam binding in each journal. So here's the envelope as you see. So that's the envelope. And um, so this, I uh, sealed this back with varnish and then I added coffee dyed paper on the inside then I added this lace so it was actually quite a bit of work with the cover itself so then lace here is um, a ribbon then I sewed it around and I added flowers with button and gemstone centers so then here's the cover and inside here is a um, tag that can be a bookmark. So it has some lace in here, cheesecloth. Actually, it's a muslin fabric and butterfly. So you can still journal here. So then here is the lace and fixed attachment for a tassel or charm or whatever. And um, it's also cheesecloth and it's muslin underneath. So it, it makes it more uh, sturdy. Then all of these journals have this pocket and that's this piece is from wallpaper book. Um, that's the fabric, I think, to match the sample, to match the uh, wallpaper. And every journal has a tag here. And then a couple tags here. This book belongs to a little ephemera. So colors are used, mostly pastel colors. Then here is a butterfly, and you can journal on a butterfly too. And that's a tag and a journaling card. Um, so mostly pastel colors, but then also uh, black because the paper I was using had these colors plus black. This is vintage book page. Um, so this is why this is punched vintage paper bag with a note paper, coffee dyed paper. I used in different colors. This is purple, uh, another vintage book page, journaling paper. This is coffee dyed pink paper doily they all have the same amount of pages so a lot of vintage book pages then this flips and there's another tag with ribbon 
and envelope with three stamped index cards. So every journal will have that. And so here is a journaling card and every journal will have this big paper clip. And then here's some more ephemera you can edit somewhere in a journal. So this is glued, the uh, will, uh, envelope. Here is more paper to journal. Doily tuck spot. And this is double tuck spot, so this is all fixed, as you can see. And two journaling cards. Uh, so the journal is nine by six and it is made with, uh, I forget, I think it's everything is going to be in the description when I'm done with uh, uploading uh, a description. Beautiful uh, book pages. So very, uh, color is very pleasing to the eye. This is pretty green. Each journal will have uh, different of these, different color. And each journal has this wired ribbon tucks up belly band. So you'll see as we go through them that they're basically the same inside. And they all have this clip, this metal uh, clip. This one has a pink one. And at the back, I also included smaller pieces to journal or to uh, add somewhere. So that's right in there. And then this envelope, I left it open. And every journal has coffee dyed paper that's folded just like that. So this one is green, I think green. So it's coffee dyed, so changed colors slightly. And then it has this stamp here. So that goes right in there. Here are the charms. So uh, every journal has this big key charm. So that's this one. I didn't glue the flowers underneath, so you can, when you tie it, you can just fix it so it looks pretty. So it's this one. Let's do this one next. Uh, this one has dark pink, I mean darker pink color lace. And this is also darker pink, this battle cap. And two gemstones, one button. So these, I, these, these three I did a little bit differently on the front, I'll show you in a second. Again, this is coffee dyed paper, uh, lace, just like the, the first one, everything is going to be the same. So it's going to be lace still here, and then you have um, a ribbon. And this is coffee dyed. Not sure if I heard something. Anyways, this is the tag with the lace and the fabric. Flowers, that's actually spooked me a little bit because I'm home alone, so. <laughs> um, and so these three journals additionally have this uh, piece of um, book page that's glued and this piece here, which is a, a tuck spot behind it. And then everything else is the same. Here's the tag. You see, I, I used Tim Holtz tickets and 
uh, ribbon. So that's the difference. This is why these are a couple of dollars more expensive because they have extra stuff. And then the rest is the same. So I'll just go quick because it's, I already talked about everything that's going to be in the journal. So here's the flip. This one is the only difference with this journal is that this one has this um, piece glued to here and uh, washi on top. Now I keep thinking about the, the sound that I, I thought somebody opened the door. So you know, I get the beeping sound. Um, this is beautiful blue color, coffee dyed paper. So I really like how the colors come together. This is off-white. It's the same as the other one. Coffee dyed yellow, botanical book pages. Is so pretty so this is going to have exactly the same they all will have these three index cards um, some have this um, I don't know what color it is it's I think pink here's the tag some will have the pink envelope and some will have blue envelope so you can have it like this or like this and here's the big paper clip Just for you. Here's the tag. So there, um, there's a lot of space to journal in these. They're pretty much writing journals. course you can do a lot of your own stuff you can even add picture here this is very good quality paper and same here you get uh, all the pieces the East Coast the Atlantic shower okay doesn't say where it is Maybe it's New York City, I can't tell. So then here you have the blue clip and three things here. This is pretty. And here's the paper, um, stamped coffee dyed paper. So this, you can open the ring and remove these things. And then you can also add stuff to, to this right here, to the split ring. You can add more things or you can remove it. Um, two more and we are done. So this one is the lavender color lace. Here are the charms, same thing. You can add more to it, you can remove it. Two buttons and a gemstone. So you see how I went with the um, seam binding underneath the flower. So this is why I didn't glue these flowers. So here's the envelope, lace, muslin fabric and muslin <laughs> sorry muslin fabric um butterflies here so i keep thinking about the door this is why i'm 
not focusing on what I'm saying. <laughs> larger piece here and this is green color paper which looks really really pretty like water in a pool when you have the, um, I think, I think when you have the green, green pool, it looks different, but whatever color you do. Um, this is the tag with the ribbon. Or when you paint the pool different colors, the water looks different. So this is like, I think when you paint it green. So this is blue paper. So I think they look really pretty together, these colors. So you see, there's a lot of copy dyed paper. I think there's at least two or maybe three that are copy dyed. And same here, you get the postcard, two journaling cards, notepad card or piece of paper and three things here. And here's the paper that's stamped. And last one. So this one, because it's black, I made this charm black as well. That, that's a feather. I don't know how well you can see it. It's like the feather that you. Um, I I was thinking that people used to write with, so it, it it worked well with the journal. And here's the key charm. See the seam binding is under the flowers. So I used ble blue seam binding to match the lace and the flowers. So two. Mm, buttons and one gemstone. Here is the tag. Uh, coffee dyed paper. And so all three, the last three journals have this stamped index card and um, this page done the same way. So it's a uh, book page and then this piece here, cardstock, and then um, here's the wallpaper book sample. And here's the butterfly. This butterfly is a little bit smaller, I just wanted to use the pink one because it matches the purple on the other side. Let's see if I can do it like that. Us looks so pretty. This green next to the purple. Okay. 
I keep turning around to see if somebody's uh, walking on me. <laughs> I'm such a paranoid person, but um, oh, this one is pink envelope. But you know, if you were sitting or recording a video and you hear like somebody's opening the door and nobody's supposed to be in the house, you can't blame me. This cute little thing. Here's a tag. And then you can also add a picture of you or picture and then put it kind of behind it. So that would make it um, like nice decoration because this will be covering the picture. Then you can write something up or down. Oh, I love this page, how it turned out. I bought the cof um, copy paper pack that had uh, different colors in one pack. It was green, blue, purple, yellow, um, blue. And then I coffee dyed and I really liked the outcome. So here are all the, the other things. So this one has pink clip, it's the paper. So that's the last journal. So the way I'm going to link these journals is I'm going to link them according to the lace on the side. So the first one is going to be light pink because this is light pink comes with a pink color seam binding. So if you didn't ha if you remove this tag, then that's how it would look. And you can have it like that. You can you don't have to have that tag on the front. You can have it just like that with this pink seam binding. Then this one is going to be dark pink because this is darker. It's not very, very dark, but it's darker than the other one, so just dark pink. And this one has this front. There's B here. This is gold. I don't know if you can see. So this is why I have yellow, a lot of yellow here. And seam binding, where's this charm? Here are the charms. So see the charms have this yellow, green, and pink to match the flowers. Then this one is going to be lavender because it has this lavender color lace. And this one has the butterflies when you open it. So when you close it, it's going to look like that. And the charm also matches all the colors here. It says, hello, love. So this one has lavender, green, yellow, pink. So this is why I have these flowers on the side. And here's the tag. And the tag, you know, the tag can go anywhere in a journal. So you can put the tag somewhere in a journal instead. Doesn't have to be on the front. And then And then the uh, black one. I really like the black butterflies. Actually, white butterflies on the black background. And black and blue charm to match the front. Pink for some contrast. So this is how it would look like without the tag. A tag can go 
somewhere in a journal. So this is going to be blue. Lavender, blue, light pink and dark pink. Okay, thank you so much for joining me and watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel to see more videos. And um, I'm going to check the house now. <laughs> I'm going to check the basement. So this video might not be uploaded, but I hope it will be. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.